a note. Maybe the first of a few. I'm not sure yet. On o scrisoare pierdută, by Luca Caracciare, in translation, a lost letter. Um, it is considered to be, for good reason, one of the best works from any literature. I'm laughing because you don't see it, but that, and you don't know what's that's soul from the dead uh, uh, beating a drum here. It's a, 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 a dog, Zara. Um, and it's useless to tell her anything because she doesn't hear me. So, there it is. Um, there will be a few things which are important in this and the other works of Caracciale. Uh, I already mentioned in a previous note, by the way, there will be a few notes on Romanian works, just a few, but many more on other, let's call them international uh, masterpieces. Uh, there are around 300, but I'm thinking, hoping that there will be quite soon 500 and more. Uh, I already have 1500 on Goodreads. So if I consider Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell, he says that with practice, in a field that you love, you can attain a, a good quality. So, in fact, it's not a question of as many as possible notes, but eventually, hopefully, uh, as good as possible. So, we have corruption. We have the theme of, theme of love, but a strange kind of love, strange love like the Depeche Mode, let's say, uh, the Depeche Mode song, um, and um, humor. Corruption, we have uh, the local politics and the national uh, arena. Uh, we have at one point uh, a candidate which is supposed to come out of the local talent pool, let's call it that, even if uh, they're actually anti-talented, <laughs> they're actually lacking in um, any skills, but they, ha <laughs> they have the ability of pulling the strings. We have the local Underwoods from the famous original House of Cards. And then, from the center, from the top, comes a, a guy, Agamitsa Dandanate, even the name is funny, in Romanian, not that it means anything, but it sounds stupid, and perhaps it is the same for uh, an English-speaking potential viewer, if there are any. Uh, when he is accepted, he needs a little shout. Otherwise, he's all over the place, uh, as you could see. So, uh, we have the prefect, uh, who's in love, well, maybe, uh, with the wife of his friend. But I'm saying maybe in love because um, um, it might just be a, a, an attraction uh, in terms of love. It, it seems to me that Karajal is not mocking the feeling, the sentiment as such, but uh, he is uh, suspicious to say the least and doesn't like the affairs that are going on. So he's, he's um, in my view, using satire, and uh, he's um, criticizing 
those infidelities, uh, uh, shenanigans, and this philandering that goes on in our and other societies. Uh, so we have, let me say, uh, in, in again in my perspective, from my perspective, uh, quite often in his plays and in this one, a sort of a, a, a local smaller Trump who is into uh, not really harassment, but uh, getting into the into intimate relationships, but into the more um, lower sort of um, engagement, if you will. The famous, infamous again, um, video with him on the bus. Uh, women, I, but they're beautiful, I just kiss them. If you're a star, they allow you everything. Just grab them by the pussy. <laughs> uh, and, and then this man starts locker talk. And I was talking at the locker, in the sauna where we meet, uh, and I was s talking with the other guys and saying, well, look, the kind of guy who does this, even in the locker room, room is not good. He's, he's just a, 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 a bracadocio, a, 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 an arrogant guy who generally, almost always, pretends he's doing things. He's bragging with the number of women he slept with, but otherwise, He's no good. I'll have to return to this um, because I didn't really get so much into a lost letter.